G'day Wester here. Hey guys and girls, um, today I'm going to do a tutorial, I'm just going to get this up close so you can see it, uh, on a Ubiquiti Edge Router X. Now I got this in from the States for $100 New Zealand, here where you buy them at um, other suppliers around $130, maybe $140. Bucks. Actually no, they're $170 I remember seeing it. Um, and they, th they just haven't come down, it's crazy. Um, so uh, they're a really good quality product. Um, Ubiquity, I don't know if you know, you've probably seen a few of my other videos, I'm not sure, but um, they are enterprise grade quality devices for a reasonable dollar value. They're actually really good. Um, this little baby's got capability of doing multiple VPNs, port forwarding, like actual real VPNs. So you can have a wireless VPN, you can have a, um, a business VPN, you can have a guest user VPN, you can do everything and configure those VPNs through, through this little device to um, have complete security across those VPNs. Um, it's, got, it's got dual fail it's got it's got dual interface failover so what that means is if you've got two ISP connections so internet service providers uh, one's on fiber and you've got a backup I don't know ADSL or um, ADSL 2 connection uh, one's on fiber who, who knows 50 50 meg plus and this one's at maybe 5 to 10 um, and you've got running a business um, the worst thing that can happen to you if you're running a business that's highly dependent on internet connection is it all goes down this little hundred dollar device has the capability of running two ISP connections if you're prepared to pay the cost of a backup and if the primary goes down your fiber or fastest one goes boom down the second one instantly does a failover almost seamlessly and you go you still continue to business but it's at a bit slower rate until you figure out what's going that's what's going to trigger you to realize oh we need to check out the internet connection and it's easy to look at the management um, software and figure out what's going wrong and then you can you know get involved with your ISP if you have to um, but for yeah value for money amazing product I think they're great um, there's a new pro product out there now called the um, what is it called it's the security ubiquity security gateway um, it's about a hundred and ninety bucks I think it is from memory in New Zealand anyway and this little baby here can do much more with the software that comes with it without having to go into the command line interface and having to uh, do keyboard entry into a you know a black screen with the green writing like matrix style stuff so um, you know and, and you've, you've got to learn how to do that and people a lot of people Joe blogs don't know how to do that so um, this here has the capability of doing much more without having to get into the CLI um, and and for the for the for the hundred dollars or even 170 bucks if you're paying full retail and you're not a, a, a tight ass like myself where I just hunt around for the best deal and go and get it I don't mind waiting two weeks three weeks a month before it gets here so um, maybe you do that that's fine you go and pay full retail that's great um, but you know really it's a really good product and um, I've been using ubiquity products for over 12 years um, you know I was working with the if you have seen some of my older videos maybe six or seven eight years ago um, you know I was doing the Pico station tutorials because the actual ubiquity website it was like unless you were a rock spider with 2,000 horsepower of IQ you couldn't even understand what the white papers were all about so I decided to start making a few videos on how to how to easily do gateways and um, you know create the networks create multiple networks and doing uh, you know, all sorts of things um, yeah any interest go and have a look at them but um, anyway so this is about this and this is about value for money and I think they're fantastic the biggest difference between this and the new security gateway is on the Unify controller software the gateway comes up with all the flash bells and whistles and the gauges and everything all green 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 whereas this is invisible to that because it doesn't actually for some reason probably a sales pitch the CLI um, and um, 
the actual graphical interface software that you're using on this device um, does <laughs> doesn't come up on the Unify software. So maybe eventually you'll be able to, you know, like the Pico stations, you'll be able to um, flash them and you know get it up to the the Unify software package. Um, but until then, you know, if you've got an ISP router. Uh, and you've got a, a, a good quality AP, which I've got some, some good quality Unify um, APs here. Um, this is the baby you want, and with, if this was your ISP uh, router, then see ya. Talk to you next time, and we're going to do uh, some setup, show you how to configure it, show you how to get into it, and...